the fuck was that shit? You know, we went into this movie with a little bit of um, curiosity, maybe a tiny sliver of hope, because you can see some of the producers on this, two in particular, had worked on Predator movie projects before. Uh, the one guy, I can't remember his name right now, sue me. He's worked on each one of the movies, so of course you're going to expect a mixed bag out of him. Because he, the same guy who was responsible for producing Predator 1, yeah, the good one, is also responsible for Predator. The Predator. Predators, Alien, Requiem, and all that shit. So, we go cautiously into the wind with this one. I was like, okay... I see an origin story. Sure, why not? Oh, hmm. The year is 1719. All right, who are you fighting? Um, fighting this chick. Oh, okay. A female heroine. Okay, we got that in the first Alien vs. Predator movie. Guilty pleasure. I actually kind of liked it. I don't know. I liked her as the character. I liked her, you know, being our first strong female to try to fight with a predator. And fight with the against the aliens at the same time. Whatever. I liked her. I was like, okay, so we're gonna try this again. So okay, tell me a little bit more about her. Well, she's uh she she's she's a kind of Comanche tribe. I'm like, well okay, um what's her weapon? Um the sticks and a tomahawk. I'm like, are you shitting me? Uh okay, I knew you were gonna you were gonna try to pull off a prequel kind of thing, but could we do a prequel somewhere where there are more viable weapons, a gun? Like, how is this gonna work out? Uh, it's gonna work out because, uh, fuck you, we're gonna make it work. We're gonna throw nonsense at the goddamn screen, and you, you better fucking accept it, because if you don't like it, hey, you don't like women. They're like, well, I don't like it, but they oh, because you're racist, you don't like the native people. I'm like, no, I don't like it because it's shit. You just... You, you, you keep milking this franchise for all this work, but not only could you not make this movie good, you're too chicken shit to release it in the theaters, Disney, and fucking you had to steal lines from previous movies. An hour and three minutes in, the fucking brother of this girl says, uh, if it bleeds, we can kill it. You know what? Do you bleed? Because, does this franchise bleed? Because it needs to be killed. Plain and simple. Leave this shit alone. When you're too chicken shit to release a movie of a franchise of this size into the theater, then maybe it's time to stop and let it fucking die. Let it rest. Let it rest. It's over. Predator, you're done. You're done. You're done. Pray. Shit.